Okay, in this tutorial, we're gonna go ahead and make this cursor move all the way to this box over here using jQuery's Animate. So the first thing we wanna do is we want to go ahead and put a handler on the square so it does something when it's clicked. So we'll say panel, and then we'll cap that off and basically what we'll do is we'll just set its HTML to that it worked now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a similar handler on the actual cursor itself so let's break these off there we go And what we want to do is when the when the cursor is clicked, go ahead and move it from here over to here and then click this with our fake cursor. So what we need to get are the coordinates for this here. So let's go ahead and have a var um, and we'll call this destination equals other side dot panel dot offset and now we're gonna do an animation on the actual cursor itself so we're gonna say animate and the first block all right we'll uh, close that one off now the first block is um, going to basically move to the actual square so we're going to go ahead and just use the properties block to set the left and the right so CSS properties and we'll say left and now we're going to say left equals destination dot left and top we want it to be destination dot top and then we want it to go for two seconds. So we'll put a little comma in here. And then our function. And in this function, we want to click the panel. So we're just gonna go ahead and copy this and say click so this is the duration it will take and this is the done function so if I go ahead and update this and run it let's see what happens okay so there's a problem oh right here so it's blue, so if we come in here and it's supposed to be a comma, it should go ahead and fix that. So let's go ahead and update it and we'll try it again. Okay, so that was kind of cool, but I, I want it to maybe go into the center. So what we'll do here is we'll say plus it's gonna be the panel Dot width and this will be plus panel dot height so now if we go ahead and rerun it it should actually go now oh so actually no it needs to be width divided by two divided by two so basically it's going to take the left up position here and it's going to go halfway this way and halfway down here and put it right in the center so it's the full width divided by two and the full height divided by two so the the cursor should end somewhere right in here there you go bingo